Well, we've had the check receiver out for a bit of tender loving care and we're now going to put it back in, connect it up and see if our tender loving care has been successful. So I'm going to slide it forward. And jiggle it in. It needs a jiggle and that's now ready for the screws to be tightened up. One down, one to go. Just play amongst yourselves while I'm doing this. There, that's ready. And the thing is on shock mounts. So you can see there's a little bit of vibration uh, removal. Down here are the connections. Uh, check receiver video out. It's fairly straightforward goes in there like that and this indicates my early remarks about the importance of labeling your cable so that's the VHF aerial goes on there the UHF aerial goes on there and the audio out is fairly straightforward. There's only one XLR and only one audio cable, but it is still labelled. Thus, and finally, the main supply. Now we'll go around the front and turn it on. Well, we've turned our check receiver on and uh, we're round, back round the back, but unfortunately these days there are no analogue television transmissions. There's the digital free view. So we have a solution. It's a converter box or budge box if you like, and this takes in free view uh, and provides a modulated analogue output on, in this case, on channel 52. And we're going to wire this up in the aerial lead. So I'll park that there, uh, and this is the uh, RF output, it has a, the Bellingly input and output sockets. So that one is marked RF in. So we unplug this which is effectively our down lead and connect that on there. And I've now got to create another lead to go from there to there, which will take a little bit of rummaging around, so I'll be back in a moment. Well, I've had a rummage in the wire box and the adapter box, and I've, um, I had to shorten that uh, to make it a bit more sanitary. And uh, uh, I've got an output connector there, which has got the right sex of Belling Lee on there, and that goes on there. It's always a mistake to have too many adapters like that. Uh, because each one offers a little bit of discontinuity in the signal path so when we've installed this correctly um, that will be reduced to a single connector of the right sort and that's the other end of that bit of wire which goes into the aerial input socket of the receiver so hopefully that is now set and ready to use seems to fit better upside down. I can blat it with a remote control then. Our next task is to nip outside and connect the aerial to the technical tailboard which comes through and ends up here. So we'll do that now. So this is our log periodic aerial. Uh, the different lengths of the uh, directors and reflectors on there uh, give you the very wide bandwidth that the uh, log periodic aerials have and that enables when the van uh, moves to different locations to accommodate uh, transmitters on different frequencies. So here is a connection from the aerial uh, and it goes in there. There's a choice of two so it's a bit 50-50. So we've connected the aerial, we've connected our bodge box and hopefully we'll be able to tune the set in. We know the bodge box uh, is outputting on channel 52 so here is the UHF tuning and oh there we are that's it and observe the tuning meter indicating the ideal position there. I'm quite pleased with that. Uh, our bodge box isn't quite satisfactory. If you look at our picture here, you'll notice it's uh, in uh, 14 by 9, and a little bit of uh, break up there. 
that I saw. Um, and really, the re aspect ratio should be 4x3. But that isn't an option on that particular bodge box. Perhaps I'll find another uh, free view adapter that will do the trick. Well, the digital break up there is the on the bodge box side because it's not on the R analog RF side because that wasn't analog uh, type break up, was it? That's technological progress for you. Yes. I wonder what channel we're we watching. It's BBC One South, I think. Is it? Yeah. What time is it? Just gone 12 o'clock. They're complaining about the quality of housing. Oh look, an aerial, did you see that? <laughs>